That's why I showed you the Bible goes into laws on a man giving his daughter away. Do they teach that in church? This is what the law says. This is when you might, they don't teach that. Bro, brother, did, did you learn that in church, brother? The, the proper age to let your daughter go away? Dude, we don't learn that in church. One more scripture. Go to um, Matthew 1 and 18. Matthew 1 18. I'm like, come back up, Ezekiel. The, law, the, the Bible goes into laws about what to eat. The Bible goes into laws about how a woman should dress. The Bible goes into laws of when is the proper age to marry. The Bible goes into laws on when you're allowed to have sex with your wife. There's a certain time. You can't have sex with your wife when she's on a period. Churches, do they teach that? No, because some men like to have sex with their wife while they're on their period. God says, no, that's against my law. You understand? Read this now. Matthew 1 and verse 18. You're 16. Oh, wait, oh, wait, okay. Yep, that's what I want. Read this. Matthew 1 and verse 18. Now the birth of Jesus Christ went on his wives. Hey, brother man, let me ask you a question. Uh, brother with the MTA uh, thing, Vestal, what's going on? Let me ask you a question, brother. Uh, Andre, you may know this too. The birth of Jesus Christ, did Joseph and Mary physically have sex? All right, you say no. What do you say? It's a very interesting topic. <laughs> Based on the laws of procreation, yeah. sex had to take place. So, okay. Based on the laws of procreation, sex had to take place. Okay, he said no. This is gonna tie into what we're talking about. Read this thing. Matthew chapter one, verse 18. Now the birth of Jesus Christ was in this wise, when as his mother Mary was a spouse to Joseph. Was a spouse to Joseph. What does it mean, a spouse? Wife. Promise. Not wife yet, promise, like engaged. Are you guys married yet when you engage? No. No. Same thing. Your daughter may be promised to a man, but she still probably didn't marry him yet. But according to your word and before the whole body, these two are promised to get married. So no man should be talking to her. Even though they're not married, leave her alone. She's espoused. Come on. Before they came together. Before they came together, what does that mean? Before Joseph and Mary had sex in a marriage chamber. You with me? Yeah. Come on. She was found with child of the Holy Ghost. But before Joseph and Mary had sex in the marriage chamber, she was found with child. Meaning what? Pregnant. Now, brothers, how do you get a woman pregnant? Sex. sex yeah. So Joseph and Mary had to have sex. But in Christianity, we learn the angel Gabriel came to Mary on a Saturday afternoon. And he saw her and the Spirit of God went in her and boom, she was pregnant. Does that, is, does that make any sense? Not logical. That's not logical. That's not logical. They had to have sex, which they did. Read 18 again. Now the birth of Jesus Christ was a force of this was, when as his mother Mary was a spouse to Joseph. Mary was promised to marry Joseph, meaning they were engaged, come on. Before they came together. Before they came together, meaning what? In a marriage chamber, because Blacks and Hispanics, we're the Israelites. We had a tradition to where on the day of the wedding, the bride and groom would go in a chamber, prepare for them, and have sex. The woman would come out, the men would come out, give the sheets to the elders of the congregation and the father. And they would hold the sheet up. And before the witnesses of everybody, what would be on that sheet? Blood. To prove she was a what? Virgin. Read 18 again. Now the birth of Jesus Christ was on this wise. When as his mother Mary was a spouse to Joseph. She was promised to Joseph, right? Come on. Before they came together. Before they came together in what? The marriage chamber. She was pregnant. Which is what? That's not according to tradition. 
Christianity took that and said, oh, see? So Joseph and Mary didn't have sex. The angel got to put That doesn't make no sense. Could you imagine an angel having sex with a brother? Come on. Man. Right, right. No problem. No problem. Yes, brother. So read this again. Now, the birth of Jesus Christ was in this wise when as his mother, Mary, was a spouse to Joseph before they came together. She was found with child of the Holy Ghost. She was found with child of the Holy Ghost, the Holy Spirit. So the Bible teaches laws on what? How to get a wife, how to remain married, to have marriage papers. The Bible teaches how women are to dress, sister. The Bible teaches that Joseph and Mary had sex, that it was not an angel that got her pregnant. The Bible teaches these things, but why don't we learn it in church? I'm Elder Nathaniel, Israel United in Christ. YouTube likes to shut our channels down, as some of you have noticed, <laughs> ever so often. Subscribing to join IUIC will assure you will always stay connected to our YouTube accounts. We want to do our best to make sure this truth gets up. Please click and join our subscriber YouTube channel called Join IUIC to stay linked to all of our videos. So again, please make sure you subscribe to this Join IUIC channel to get your latest updates on all our YouTube channels. Shalom.